So in this video, I just want to go over what this contraption is. It's on the side of majority of any newer package units that have been installed. I've had a lot of coworkers that are newer to the trade ask me what it is or what the purpose of it is. Um, or just in talking with them, I can tell they have no idea what it is. A lot of times they come uh, with the economizer kit. Um, it's a barometric relief damper. Um, and what that is, is basically it's supposed to help prevent the building from being overpressurized. Um, there's usually this, on, this is a train package unit here. Um, usually this screen right here is in, the, in place to help prevent any animals or things from getting in if these are open. Um, but yeah, with that being said, basically the whole purpose of it is to help keep the building from being overpressurized. Um, and it's just the path of least resistance essentially. And you can see these are just dampers here that if there's, if the building gets overpressurized, they're gonna open uh, and help relieve some of that pressure. Um, some of the ways you might know if your building is overpressurized is you might have doors, especially like a front door of like a convenience store or something like that that's just kind of like stuck jarred open all the time. Uh, sometimes I've heard people say like you can hear whistling uh, like in an elevator or around an elevator just from air, that overpressurized air trying to escape. Um, so that, that's a couple of things that's hopefully supposed to prevent uh, instead of opening up a, you know, a push door in the front, you know, keeping it jarred open with pressure escaping that way. It's just going to open this where down in the space, the tenant or occupant is going to have no idea any of that's going on, but it's going to make it a little bit more comfortable feel and not obviously have those kind of nuisance -y things uh, happening. Um, they're ideally basically just put on the return side um, of these uh, package units. Uh, there's many a different ones uh, and different makes and, and models of equipment that have it. Uh, this, like I said, is a train. The one over here, I'll just walk over here since it's right here, is um, a York package unit and it has a very similar setup. Um, let's see, yeah, right here. So this one is actually pretty jarred up. It's pretty tight, um, so it's not gonna let the air escape like it should. Um, I am kind of surprised I don't have any type of a screen to go over this. Um, and the particular area where I'm at is pretty close to salt water. We got a lot of seagulls, a lot of birds, a lot of pigeons, stuff like that. Um, I mean, if you had a building that was essentially always overpressurized for some reason or another, you know, these could be jarred open. Oh, never mind. There's, there's my screen. So they did it different than the way Train did it. So they have their screen right here. And this is, like I said, to help prevent things from getting in there. So they do still um, have that protective screen as well. They just have a different way of doing it. Um, but where I was going with that is if this was obviously jarred open all the time, if you had no protective screen, stuff's gonna crawl and get into your duct work uh, and get into your return duct work pretty easily. Um, and then just to kind of come over here and kind of see the other side of it, um, you obviously can't see it that well, but you can kind of see in there um, going down. That's just my drop, uh, return air drop going down below. Um, and then obviously my economizer dampers are all right here. If I'm bringing in outside or inside air, I'll go over an economizer in a different video at some point. Um, but mostly just this barometric relief damper. Just want to kind of go over it. Honestly, even early on in my career, I didn't quite understand what it was or why we always added it. Um, and then you can also get other scenarios where if you have like a horizontal duct coming off of this, if like your duct works on the roof, kind of like this package unit right here, you can see the duct work is on the roof. Um, a lot of times those, these will be added just to the side of the duct work. So they'll just cut out the side of the duct work and that's where they would go. Um, but yeah, it, it's pretty important to have, like I said, I think it makes the, the, your, your tenant or occupant of the building uh, a lot happier having them. Um, they weren't on a lot of the older older package units, but now we're, we're at, it's kind of part of the code uh, to have them on. So if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Feel free 
for those of you who have experience with them add something in the comment if you have any any notes or tips to add uh, please subscribe and thank you guys for watching